Hello and welcome to Paws Channel. Our video today is about a dog attacking a badger and paying the price. Badgers are considered tough primarily due to their physical characteristics, behavior, and evolutionary adaptations. Badgers have compact, muscular bodies with powerful limbs. This gives them the strength to dig through tough soils and confront predators. They possess long, sturdy claws that are adapted for digging. These claws also serve as formidable weapons for self-defense. Badgers are known for their aggressive nature when confronted. They are not easily intimidated, which can make them appear tough and unyielding. Badgers are generally not aggressive towards humans and will typically avoid direct contact if possible. However, there are situations where a badger might exhibit defensive behavior that can lead to an attack. If a badger is provoked, cornered, or feels agitated, it may respond by trying to defend itself. This can happen if a human tries to interact with or handle a wild badger. Over millions of years, badgers have evolved with a strong drive for survival. Their ancestors were likely individuals who exhibited traits like determination and resilience, which allowed them to thrive in various environments. Badgers are known for their bold and fearless nature. This trait can make them appear exceptionally resilient and determined, even in the face of potential danger. Badgers have evolved specific traits and behaviors that contribute to their overall robustness. These adaptations include their territorial behavior, burrowing abilities, and a diverse diet, all of which contribute to their perceived strength. Not all dogs can handle a badger especially the African honey badger that has a reputation of fending off big cats too. However, some breeds that were bred for hunting purposes, particularly for pursuing quarry like foxes, raccoons, and other small game have the ability to take down smaller badgers like stink and ferret badgers. However, it doesn't stop them from attacking or handling the larger badger species such as European badgers. Jag terriers for example were bred to hunt small game and they are very good at it. They can handle a badger loads better as compared to a dog that wasn't bred for hunting purposes. At the same time engaging a larger badger in a fight could pose serious risks to a yog terrier as well. The badger's natural defenses, combined with its powerful physique, make it a formidable opponent for most animals, including dogs. This large sheepdog was still a pup and was in the process of learning the art of hunting. It clearly didn't know what it was messing with, it took the badger far too lightly and due to lack of experience it learned a lesson that it will never forget in its lifetime. Actually sheepdogs are totally different than livestock guardian dogs. Sheepdogs, particularly those bred for herding purposes, are not typically equipped or trained to engage in combat with wild animals like badgers. Their primary function is to assist in herding and protecting livestock, particularly sheep. They are valued for their intelligence, obedience, and ability to work closely with humans. Livestock guardian dogs on the other hand are a specific type of working dog breed that have been bred and trained to protect livestock from predators. These dogs are typically large, powerful, and possess protective instincts. Breeds like the Anatolian Shepherd, Great Pyrenees, Marema Sheepdog, and Congal are examples of LGDs, which will engage in a fight with predators if they have to. It is crucial to remember that even if a dog has a historical background in hunting, it does not guarantee success or safety in an encounter with a badger. Badgers are powerful and formidable animals with strong natural defenses. Engaging in such activities is unsafe for both the dog and the badger, and it can cause unnecessary harm and suffering. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to like, comment and share the video.